Hi, I'm Olivia from the Huber Heights branch of the Dayton Metro Library. In the book we're reading this week, Flora and Ulysses, The Illuminated Adventures by Kate DiCamillo, Ulysses the squirrel gets sucked into a giant vacuum and comes out with superpowers. He even gets super strength, the ability to lift objects that should be way too heavy for him. What if you needed to lift a heavy object without super strength? The answer is literally simple. You can use a simple machine like a pulley. Let's look at how to put one together. You will need two cardboard tubes. Paper towel tubes work best, but if you only have toilet paper rolls, that'll work too. And you'll also need a spool of ribbon or thread, a pencil, straw, or wooden skewer, and string, ribbon, or yarn if your spool is empty. Now ours already has string, so we're good. And then we'll need tape, scissors, and a small basket or container. First, you need to cut two notches out of the paper towel tube, just big enough for the pencil to fit through. So these notches are gonna go on one end of our tube. It doesn't need to be that deep or that wide. Just think about a pencil, it's kind of narrow. But we want to make sure it's not so tight that the pencil can't move because later on we'll find out what that pencil is going to be for. So I'm just going to double check to make sure my pencil fits and perfect. Next, tape the two cardboard tubes to a solid surface like a table. And for this, we're going to need several pieces of tape. I would recommend masking tape because it's a little bit sturdier. And we're going to put it around all the edges just so it doesn't tip over. So for this next step, we are going to take our spool with our thread and here's our bucket. I feel like ours is a little big, but we'll make it work. If you have a bucket in your house that's even bigger or smaller, you could use that. Just make sure that there's enough space underneath the pencil. That way you can actually move the bucket. And I'm going to swing this around just so we can see better. I've pulled it through. That way when it lifts up, it'll be sort of like a triangle right here and we're gonna tie it just so it all stays together. Now, we're gonna bring out this pencil right here and we're gonna slide it through. Make sure it fits through the spool, whatever you're using. And then I'm gonna recommend taking some more tape to attach your spool to your pencil. Otherwise, the pencil will just roll around inside that spool and it won't be able to pull up the bucket. All right, let's see what we got. We'll slide it right here. We'll take our bucket here and we'll turn, 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 and ta-da, we have liftoff and drop down. How does it work? The weight of the object pulls down the string, creating tension in the string. There's that tension. The pulley redirects the tension by pulling it up. You want the object to lift up, but the pulley lets you pull the string down in the same direction as gravity, which means you can lift the object with less force. That's all for today. Remember to add this program to your summer challenge. Thank you for watching.